putting together a poetry collection, boys, is like the NRL Nines, Eden Park, 45,000 packed. You've got 90 pages of lines to work the eclectic crowd into some kind of synthesis, some kind of wonderful. But your poems are... Len Brown twins, arm in arm, yokling up the stairs. Fred Flintstone and Wilma jiving in fluffy pig's feet and ears. Vikings thundering with axes, tiny elves digging the seats. Their spades are used to ward off purple flower-potted peeps. But your poems are... Tigers slapping their tails over Shirley Temple's moko. Doctors in white coats, stethoscope shouting, everybody's loco. Rabbit heads on lime lettuce beds, sipping carve zero sav blanc. Thinking boldly, treading lightly, but always spilling the plonk. Cavemen with mismatching beards, but strangely matching socks. They club the French barmaids in black and white whose hairy chests cause shocks. Under tutus, French suspenders should always be kept out of sight. It's obvious that poem's been round the block, a poem of the night. But your poems are shimmering pharaohs, smiling sombreroed ukulele strumming Mexicans, turquoise caped commandos, X-Men bravados guarded by Roman centurions. They are Batmen, jesters, jailers, Uncle Festers, beach babes wearing tuxedos. They herd round the two-person brown cow wherever the front goes, the back goes. They are pirates swinging swords, slashing the hordes, crowded round bare-breasted mermaids. Where's Wally keeps looking high and low, searching for the contrabanding French barmaids. Mary Poppins flirts, loses his skirt, now looks like a K-Road gigolo. He lands next to Biff, who thrives on a whiff of mustachioed fame from the footy show. And when your poems are cat calls, crowd surfing balls and transparent floating condoms, foaming hands, portable bandstands and flying chitty chitty bang bangs, aloha shirts and lays perverted on brawny browned muscle men, loose blonde hair flicking everywhere hiding the rum and semen. Dwarves riding astride, blown-up dragons wearing Rastafarian wigs, black silver warriors selfie preening, smooching the life-size lipsticks. And when your poems are Transformers policing while cracking a woody, gangsters throwing shade from under black hoodies, Zumba dancing bananas, front peels hanging down, expose fruit signed by all around... Then you know, boys, putting together a poetry collection means sinking this kind of crowd where flicking the page like a Mexican wave has got to leave the reader wowed. Mm-hmm.